in terms of football, I try to speak well with one voice. Uh, we have been neglected uh, for uh, so many years, and uh, we have been devalued. That we are now, now trying to uh, value ourselves. We have been uh, marginalized uh, for a long time. Uh, you see, uh, the guys uh, we have been uh, running football have told us that uh, we are not educated. Uh, we are only educated to coach football uh, in terms of administration, marketing, you know, those kind of things. We are not considered uh, But uh, I like to believe that. Uh, Wisdom is better than uh, being a fluent uh, in English. And, uh, they say uh, most of the languages, okay, it's not a measure of uh, one's intelligence. It's uh, they're just a way of uh, communicating. So we are trying to open uh, uh, our minds and uh, say that uh, men should think beyond uh, this reason. So, so, so who, are, who are you working with? Basically, we are working uh, with uh, everyone who is interested in uh, seeing that uh, our football uh, competes with the rest of the world. So, in other words, they are trying to do what form it is trying to organize. We are not uh, of, uh, trying to organize uh, anything in the different. Uh, just like uh, you are saying, uh, that uh, we are trying to open it. No, we are in Zifa. We, are, we have been excluded. We, we want to be uh, included. So that uh, our voices are heard. What, what exactly is that you want to, What part do you want to play exactly? In making sure that uh, Zifa becomes uh, competitive. Zifa should be concentrating on uh, the grassroots and uh, the national teams. So we, we have to qualify for competitions. And uh, quali not just qualifying, but uh, winning the competitions. We don't want to, to, to just participate, but we want to be uh, competitors. So and, uh, we are lagging behind them because uh, look at uh, Bellingham, it costs about uh, 110 million pounds. What does that mean to us? Football is becoming as a business. And uh, we are lagging behind them. Uh, we have taken uh, 43 steps. We are going to, but we have taken 100 steps. We have taken 100 steps. So who is this beer in this? Who is this beer in this? The former players, uh, like uh, we have said, uh, we want to uh, whatever you want to put uh, in uh, all, all, all the regions, all the provinces uh, in Zimbabwe. So specifically here in Mashingo, who uh, have you met? And, uh... Uh, we are meeting now uh, with these guys. Football committee, even you, you are involved to give us advice. But advice is for free, it's not a. It's a up to you to take it away. You, you can tell us what to do, that uh, we can do this and that uh, so that our football uh, becomes uh, great. We have heard recently uh, a caretaker man, a caretaker of coach being selected, uh, Brito. What's your comment? My comment, uh, shall I speak no evil, see no evil, hear no evil. Uh, that's a statement. Uh, how we elaborate it. <laughs> well, what about the type of players that have been that, uh, selected? For example, the type of players are... Uh, we have to wake up there because our COVID has affected us a lot. I think uh, two or so, two and a half years, 
after COVID, and uh, there was nothing uh, being done. And uh, I think it, two years without participating, you can say it's two years. But for me, I do understand that football. Okay, it can be 20 years. Yeah. So at the moment, what are you? Because we are saying uh, that uh, uh, youngster who was 19, okay. After that two years, uh, he's, he's still uh, 19, he's 21. So he has missed a lot um, in that development. Those two years are very important in the very critical. Are you in the coaching at the moment? I've always been in the coaching and the football has always been my life. So which team is uh, which team are you coaching? At the moment, I'm um, concentrating on my academy, which is in uh, uh, Division 2. What is the name of the MBC. Okay. Mm -hmm. What is in Division 2 in Arabi? Division 2 in Arabi, 2B. Two, two, two and then I uh, just recently have been to, I'm coming from Jerry, and uh, they had uh, a good project, uh, which I uh, recommend to all uh, people concerned to develop our football. You know, for example, like uh, in Czech Stadium, okay, uh, they are renovating uh, their main stadium. And that loan from uh, the stadium, they dug it and uh, replanted it uh, on a DPB, DPB yeah. arena so that the, the stadiums are not, uh, uh, there's no too much pressure. The grass, the grass can uh, regenerate, and, uh, but it needs funding. And uh, for our football to, to go forward, it needs, it needs funding. But what way do you see our uh, football in the next five years? In the next five years, then we will uh, work on uh, the short term, medium term, and uh, long term. But at the moment, I'm not uh, the, the one who's uh, planning the. Uh, so I, I don't know about the, the future. Where, where do you sell your players? Like I said, the COVID has affected us a lot. Uh, we'll be talking in the next two years. Yeah, we are still uh, rebuilding from uh, this pandemic.